Tonight, the Belmont Clemmy Community School District is mourning the loss of a beloved teacher. Jason Englert's family says he tested positive for coronavirus three days before he died. KCCI's Lara Terrell spoke with the superintendent about the teacher's lasting impact. Jason was always such a pleasure to have uh, because he had a, such a positive attitude and a lot of energy and the rapport he had with students was remarkable. Devastation and sadness are sweeping through the Belmont Clemmy Community School District after the death of beloved teacher Jason Inglert. The 38 year old was found dead inside his home on November 8th. His family tells KCCI he tested positive for coronavirus just three days before. For the students, of course, it was such a shock at first. Uh, many of our students had trouble knowing how to register this. Wright County has been hit hard with the virus. That's why the Belmont Clemmy School District did a mass testing last week. Englert's family says that's how he learned he was positive and eventually started to develop a slight headache. This has affected me significantly. Superintendent Daniel Frazier coached volleyball alongside Englert. He says not only was he an exceptional coach, but also a brilliant teacher who taught students in the gifted program. He was just a very energetic guy and he always had a cheerful way of looking at things. It wasn't unusual for me to ask him how he was going and he would say things like living the dream. That dream of teaching led Ingler to a few school districts over his career. Family and colleagues say his impact on students will be his lasting legacy. We continue to mourn for a loss and we pray for Jason's family. Laura Terrell, KCCI 8 News, Iowa's news leader. Englert's family says they don't believe that he had any underlying health conditions. They say they don't have an official cause of death yet, but they wonder if the virus spurred a heart attack or a stroke.